Tuomas Lauri Johannes Holopainen is a Finnish songwriter, multi-instrumentalist and record producer, best known as the founder, leader, keyboardist and songwriter of symphonic metal band Nightwish. He has also studied jazz and classical styles, but prefers to be influenced by harmonic film music. Before founding Nightwish, he played in the band Darkwoods My Betrothed. He later recorded an album with them as a full member in 2020. He also collaborated with the gothic metal band For My Pain and the band of Timo Roshanen. Holopainen has written several songs that have been included in movie soundtracks, including a collaboration with Nightwish bass player and male vocalist Marco Heidelo on While Your Lips Are Still Red, for the Finnish film Liexa. In 2007, he also co-wrote the music for Nightwish's own film, Imaginarum, released in November 2012. Holopainen released his first solo album music inspired by the life and times of Scrooge in 2014. Tuomas Holopainen was born in Kite, Finland, on December 25, 1976. His parents were entrepreneur Pendi Holopainen and Kirsti Norsha Holopainen, a former music and English teacher in a small elementary school. He has an older sister named Susanna who works as a surgeon urologist, and an older brother named Petri who is an autopsy assistant. He and singer Alina Cyrilla are second cousins. His musicality and skill in text expression showed early in school. His mother signed him up for piano class in school when he was seven years old, and he later studied clarinet, tenor saxophone, piano and music theory for 12 years at a music college. However, he has not played the clarinet nor the saxophone since the mid-90s. Originally aspiring to be a biologist, Holopainen had no interest in metal until his school foreign exchange partner took him to see Metallica and Guns N' Roses in America, and he became hooked. Holopainen is a fan of Disney, Tolkien, and Dragonlance. In 2006 Holopainen said that he is not religious, but an open-minded, thinking individual. He does not consider religion to be bad, but human interpretation of it. Holopainen married Finnish pop singer Joanna Kirklaw on October 28, 2015. He is a vegetarian. A new insect species, Cyophilia holopini, discovered by a Finnish biologist named Yuka Salmela of Metsahalitis Parks and Wildlife, has been named after Tuomas Holopainen, because of Holopainen's love for nature. Holopainen joined his first bands in 1991. He played in several bands, including recording keyboards for three albums with black metal band Darkwoods My Betrothed and playing with Dismal Silence, Natfindens Gra, and Sethian. He was then conscripted for the Finnish army, where he managed to earn a position as the clarinet player of the military band, which spared him from gun-related activities. In July 1996, a 19-year-old Holopainen began thinking of starting a band of his own, for which he would write the music and play keyboards. This was the birth of Nightwish, around a campfire. He asked Ernu and Pu Vorinen and classmate Tarja Turinen to join what was then an acoustic project, with music he wrote during his time in the army. After hearing Tarja's strong voice, and because of the metal influences of Vorinen and drummer Yuka Nevelainen, Tuomas decided to turn Nightwish into a metal act. Before becoming a full-time musician, Holopainen worked for two years as a high school stand-in teacher in his hometown. Nightwish's first non-demo release, Angels Fall First, came in 1997, followed by Ocean Born in 1998. In 1999, Holopainen and members of other Finnish metal acts like Embrace, Eternal Tears of Sorrow, Karen and Reflection started the gothic metal supergroup For My Pain. However, as all the members were busy with their own bands, the project was postponed for the future. Nightwish's third studio album, Wishmaster, was released in 2000. The third release sold even better than the previous album. In 2001, again the idea for My Pain was brought up and the members started planning a debut. Nightwish Live in 2005 In Nightwish's fourth studio album Century Child, released in 2002, Holopainen began collaborating with symphonic orchestras from Finland and the United Kingdom, which was a change in the band's music and Holopainen's style of composition, and also allowed for more freedom with additional instruments. The use of orchestral elements has been present in the studio album releases from Nightwish as of April 10, 2020. In 2003, For My Pain released its debut album, entitled Fallen. The album was received well, but the band has since lost fans due to a lack of new albums dash for the same reason that Fallen was delayed by four years. In 2004 For My Pain released Killing Romance, a Finnish single with three previously unreleased tracks, Killing Romance, Jotsunla Ulu and Too Sad to Live. Nightwish's fifth studio album, 
once was released in 2004, and became their US breakthrough. Singles Nemo and Wish I Had an Angel were played on MTV. Nightwish started their most extensive tour to date, the once world tour, visiting several countries, like Japan, for the first time. After the last concert, in October 2005, Nightwish gave vocalist Tarya Turinen a letter explaining her dismissal from the band. In 2006, Holopinen went through a dark period filled with anxiety and depression, made worse by rumors about himself and Nightwish in the tabloids every day. These events also inspired him in the writing of Dark Passion Play, Nightwish's sixth album. Nightwish live in Melbourne, Australia, on January 30, 2008. After heavy metal singer Timo Roshanen's breakup of trio Niskalaukhaus, he published his first solo album titled Sarvavari with a crew gathered from different bands, including Holopinen on keyboards. Holopinen also wrote one song on the album. Early the next year, For My Pain, announced that they would soon start recording the successor to Fallen, but it was reported in the same autumn that the album once again was postponed. In April 2007 Holopinen collaborated with fellow Nightwish member Marco Heidela to write a theme song for the Finnish film Liexa. The song, While Your Lips Are Still Red, was the first song he had written specifically for a film, though several Nightwish songs have been included in film soundtracks. Holopinen has said that writing film scores is something he would like to do in the future. On While Your Lips Are Still Red, in addition to Holopinen on piano, Marco Heidela performs vocals and acoustic bass guitar, and Yuka Nevelinen plays drums. In 2007, Holopinen played keyboards with Finnish punk band Kyla Hullet on their EP Liza Persetta Rotipila. He would return to play keyboards on their following album Peralco Savistaiksessa. Holopinen can be heard singing with the chorus on both of these releases. The new vocalist for Nightwish was revealed in May 2007, Sweet Annette Olsen, who appears on Dark Passion Play, released in late August of the same year. On May 8, 2008, it was announced that Holopinen would be the producer of Finnish pop-slash-rock band Indica's next album, Veloisa, which was released in the fall of 2008. Holopinen was credited for helping to create the Finnish trance artist Orkidea's third album, Metaverse in 2008, for the collaboration in Orkidea's version of Nightwish's song Bye Bye Beautiful. Nightwish's seventh studio album, Imaginarum, was released on November 30, 2011 in Finland and in North America on January 10, 2012. Holopinen originally confirmed that he was producing a solo project in 2012. Holopinen stated on his website, The Escapist, that he planned to devote his time completely to songwriting for the project in February to April 2013 after the Nightwish Imaginarum tour. In 2014 he released music inspired by The Life and Times of Scrooge based on the comic book series The Life and Times of Scrooge McDuck by Don Rosa. The record featured Nightwish musician Troy Donnickley as well as the London session musicians used previously in recent Nightwish releases. In a November 2015 interview, he revealed plans to release a book with short fantasy and horror stories influenced by Neil Gaiman and Stephen King. Holopinen also composed the song Low 2 for Year 2015 Concert Live Aid ULS 2017. Holopinen lived with Nightwish in Paris, France, on April 6, 2008 Holopinen is a source of inspiration for other bands, especially within symphonic, gothic and power metal. Simone Simons, lead singer of Epica, stated that she began singing due to Nightwish. Ex-singer of Visions of Atlantis, Nicole Bogner, also acknowledged that Nightwish had greatly inspired the band, especially for their first album. Sander Gommens of After Forever said that Nightwish will certainly influence us in creating new songs. Finnish power metal band Sonata Arctica's lead singer Tony Kako, who has worked with Nightwish both in making the Beauty and the Beast duet with Tarja Turunen and as a crowd warmer, several times explained how much of an influence Nightwish is for him. In the early days of Nightwish, Holopinen was the band's male vocalist, performing all male vocals on Angels Fall First. For subsequent releases up until the arrival of bassist and male vocalist Marco Heidela, the band has recruited sessional male vocalists, as Holopinen preferred to focus entirely on his keyboards. However, he did sing Beauty and the Beast Live if the band did not have a sessional singer available, contributed vocals to the track The Carpenter. On Angels Fall First and chanting to the track Moon Dance on Oceanborn as well as vocals on Master Passion Greed. Although these songs are never performed live, with the exceptions of The Carpenter, which was performed by Tuomas at the Tavastia Club. Helsinki in 1998, and again during the decades, World Tour in 2018, but the male vocals are performed by Troy Donnickley instead. 
He also performed the whispering in the background on while your lips are still red, but he does not do this live. Thanks for watching.